people of our community to come into school. I learn patience while waiting for the younger children to choose their prizes. I learn friendship and respect. I have to respect other people's decisions on which crafts to make and how to set up their stalls. A good leader listens to other people's views and negotiates. A good leader communicates with their team. community together so we created forest baubles which are reusable and d don't damage the environment they also bring joy to people at christmas because they can reuse them every year and they are decorating their house for the festive time Christmas, especially to elderly people. So we made decorations for people and sold them. We had a coffee morning in our hall and made over £200. We made cakes and got sent a lot of things from other companies. To spread joy, we went carol singing in our local area. With a donation bucket, we made just over £70. Also, we made poems for some care homes and with the extra decorations, we gave to another care home. profits and losses. We managed how much money we made. I made the logo. Hi, we are the design team. We created mm -hmm. posters and signs for all the stalls. raise money for Age UK. There are a lot of things along the way included. To manage money. To build and run a successful business. To help people in our community. Be a team and have patience with each other. Brave and not shy. Be carefully to each other and not judging our skills harshly. And to be passionate.
gone up so elderly and vulnerable people can't use their heating during the winter and we have raised an astonishing £2,100 and behind me you will see the contents of our pack, pack. and 100% of our money that we have raised has been spent on them and we hope that they will make a difference in the winter. Christmas decorations and wrapping paper. You sold them at the Christmas fair. A good leader is being kind, being responsible, always prepared. The best thing of Bright Stars was meeting new friends. <laughs> project focused on helping children create lasting memories with their families over the holidays on a budget. We really enjoyed selling outside to the public and sharing our creations. So we were sending letters out to people, so we were asking if we could use their stuff. I sent it out to Mrs Branny's husband, asking if we could use his um, 3D printers and that to use to make snowflakes. We're going to sell them to make money for the food, the food bank.
how how our dogs eating helps others and we learned interesting new facts about the animals we research to make our cards. some hot drinks and a biscuit. We were going to buy a kindness cup for, for the community if they do something kind. And um, the rest, and then half of it we're going to use for the kindness cup and then the other half we're going to give to charity. We were going